Hey, how's it going? My name is Matt. Today I'm gonna to walk you through how to download a SIA wallet and go through a couple steps um, and some challenges that I had when I was downloading this and uh, putting it onto my, my MacBook Pro. So um, just gonna walk you through what I found works. Uh, don't know if this is exactly the way you should do it, but I looked on some forums and saw there, that there wasn't a video out there for how to do this for, uh, for Mac. So I'm gonna go ahead and go through it real quick. Um, so this is the uh, SIA website. It's SIA.tech. This is the website you're gonna go to in order to download their wallet. Um, this is the home page. Right up here, you're gonna see the download. Uh, you're gonna go ahead and click on that. It's gonna download. And then you're simply gonna click on download for Mac right here. All right, so once that downloads, it'll open up and you might have to change your, your settings for your uh, uh, security settings because I had to do that as well where I just had to go up here to uh, uh, my system preferences, click on that. And I went to security. And when I went into security, I just checked here and then uh, did my password and then clicked here to where it says that I'm allowed to download apps from anywhere. It downloaded and everything was fine. Once I downloaded it, ran the program, it opened. But one of the issues I was having was is that it wasn't syncing up. And if I open it up now, there it is, the SIA wallet. It's still synchronizing, but you can see here you have files, you have hosting, wallet, terminal, and about. Right now, we're, we're, I'm using the uh, version 1.3.0. They're gonna be coming out with a new version here shortly, 1.3.1. Now this is gonna be uh, fixing some of the bugs, but uh, uh, in the meantime, what you can do to, um, to get your synchronization happening is you can go to terminal and you're gonna uh, input some gateways in here. And where I found the gateways, I went here to communities and I went down to forum and checked out the form. So I did the search here. I, I searched for synchronizing my uh, MacBook Pro and uh, found this link here, which was really helpful. It's down further on the list right now, but um, uh, it was very helpful. <clears throat> it has a couple links on where to go to download or to, to run these gateways. Uh, right here gives you a full version. So what I did, I just copied and pasted that full version into a um, little text wrangler. So here are all the different gateways and uh, so what I did was I opened up my, my SIA, went to terminal, and I just started copying and pasting. So copy, paste, and enter. And you can see this little, mach little gear going. And what that gear is doing is looking to uh, add this gateway. And uh, once it starts adding the gateway, and so you're just gonna keep going until you see it say an accepted gateway. So we keep going, enter, it's working, it's working, could not appear. Uh, add this peer, so you can keep going. And you'll eventually find a couple that will work. <clears throat> and once you get them working, you're gonna see that it's going to start synchronizing. And it's gonna keep going, could not add peer. So we're gonna keep going. All right, this can take a little bit of time. And Add peer, and yeah, I give you a lot of gateways here in the meantime. All right, so it's still working. Copy this one here, and I'm just keep going until I get all of them done. <clears throat> All right, perfect, you can see it added one right there. So once you've added a gateway, it's gonna take a little bit of time to synchronize, but once you're done synchronizing, up here in the upper right-hand corner, it's gonna say synchronized. And if it, if it says uh, no peer detected, just give it a minute, it'll, it'll uh, sync back up again, uh, but it'll also give you a block height here. And uh, that's how you get your, your SIA wallet uh, downloaded to your MacBook Pro or any Mac device. Um, easy way to do it and uh, now you can go in and 
transfer, transfer uh, SIA coin or create folders. You can actually use the SIA uh, system to um, allow files to be shared on your, on your computer and uh, you get uh, uh, paid out for letting them use your, your uh, storage space that you're not using right now. So it's kind of cool, a uh, good way to earn some extra SIA uh, coins. So uh, I love uh, cryptocurrencies. I think it's a super cool way to uh, exchange and uh, create value. And uh, um, one other product that I found that works really well is the uh, USI-Tech. Dot, or USI -tech. And um, that is a great way of multiplying or compounding your Bitcoin and uh, earning more and more Bitcoin. And uh, it's a great system. So if you want more information about that, uh, you can click on the link below um, in the comment section about uh, how to get started there. And uh, I'll uh, leave my contact information. You can get a hold of me if you have any questions. So I uh, hope you guys all have a great rest of your day. And I'll talk to you then. Take care.